MTD CNC, bringing you the latest engineering news via video media. Giovanni, First MTA, a well-known work holding company. Can you tell me about this product here at Emo Encore? This is a new innovative product from Technomagneti. Uh, we became UK agents for them um, over a year ago now. Um, it's new innovative technology. It's the first time that it's been uh, displayed on a machine in the UK. Um, its unique qualities are that, as you can see, there's no toe clamps to this equipment. Um, it independently magnetises to the machine bed and then independently magnetises to the components. Um, the reason for that is, it's not so you don't have to use toe clamps, but so you get a uniform clamping effect. Um, and it eliminates vibration, uh, which in course you get faster feeds and speeds. Um, and you can hit the components harder. Okay, we've got the doors open on this VTC here. What's going to happen when I start machining? Um, well, you're going to machine the component, hit the component as hard as you, you, you would like. Um, the machine is independent from the, the, the connection point here. It's, it's been magnetised to the machine bed and it will stay magnetised until um, you put the connector in and reverse the polarity, even if you add a power cut. So even if I had a power cut, the component is going nowhere? No, it's not going nowhere. There's 25 poles under each of these components, 450 mil square, uh, which generates a vertic vertical clamping force of 15 tonne. 15 tonne, wow. Yeah. What happens if I've got a component with a very thin wall thickness? Um, dependent on the wall thickness, we would supply, if it was 20 mil, below 20 mil, we would supply a thin pole, a fine pole a magnetic chuck. And um, this is for heavy duty machining. And um, so we've got different uh, magnets dependent on the application. I can see it being a huge benefit to the mould and dye industry, but are there any other sectors who would invest in this form of technology? Oh yeah, most certainly. Anyone with large components, the railway industry, uh, for example. Uh, but not just for large components, if you're a subcontract company where you're doing large components or small components, if you've got this equipment on the machine bed, um, the full top surface is, is fully machinable and without the uh, pole extensions on, which that means you can incorporate round and diamond pin sets and, and put your vices on, chucks on, so if you wanted to machine aluminium work you still can do and it will give you a zero point uh, system um, which could also interface with the machine if you were looking to robot load. Okay, and First MTA are also agents for the very popular Chick Vice. Is this the beginning of the end for the Chick Vice? Oh no, definitely not. Uh, Technomagneti is predominantly for large components. Chick is for, uh, you know, middle of the range kind of size components, aerospace components, medical components. So our products are all application specific. Okay, and this sits away from the machine tool, presumably, so it can be used on any CNC? It can be used on three axis machines, horizontal machines, and fifth axis machines, um, with unique qualities on all. Okay, so if I apply it on a five axis machine and the bed's tilted at 90 degrees, so the component's effectively in thin air, is that an issue? No, not at all, because again, dependent on the surface area covered by the component, it creates a certain tonnage of clamping force. So if you were holding it in a vice and you get five tonne clamping force, it's exactly the same. Thanks a lot. Thank you.